Good afternoon, welcome to Nijmegen, Netherlands. This is Murat. We are in front of Stevenskerk. Stevens Church is from 16th century, as I read on Wikipedia. As the entrance is free to enter, no price, it's not like a museum. Unlike the other churches of the Netherlands, usually the big churches are uh, with some payments entry fees, but not this one. Let me show you first if I can do in the beginning. I don't know if they allowed because I didn't ask. Hello, Leo Hartmann. It's a beautiful day in Nijmegen, by the way. Oops. Oops. We got the windows. <coughs> Hello, Wang Tong. Those are graves, I think. Right. Guys, it's beautiful. Soon we will go out and I'm gonna show you the local market and some shopping streets. We have exactly one hour the maximum I think because after that I have to go somewhere else to meet my friends let's take a selfie with this church organ hello Colleen hello welcome hope you are well it's the sailing Hello, Quinton Joshua, Sunny SA. Hello, Mountain Network Resources. It's also sunny here. We are just having a quick tour and then we will go out and check the local market and shopping streets. Look at the door. Must be prison in the past. Hello Element 99 I saw a big organ here Let me show you In Stavinskirk Here it is Right Let's go out And check the vibes on the street Look at that. Merhaba, Fahir Köksel. Teşekkürler. Good evening, Indonesia, Reza. This might be an event room. Special room is here. Hello, Paola Melo. Hello, Leslie. 
We have so many friends here today. And Wang Bong from California. All right. This is the end of our quick tour, quick church tour. Now I go out. Hello, Bora, Merhaba. Look at this building. Dave Silver, Merhaba, hello. It's the backyard of the church. So it says it was a school, a Latin school. It's built in 1545 and restored in 1975. I think I think it looks gorgeous. Uh, look at the church. This is the church we were inside. And this passage open to the marketplace directly what a great entrance to the church and the way house is over there this is the marketplace Previous time I had visited Nijmegen, the local market was here, but now they moved it on the street, the side street. Some people are having some baths on the sun chairs on 16 Celsius. <laughs> Hello Elizabeth, hello Vijay, Matt, Merhaba, Teşekkürler, Tibor, hello. Allah korusun Mert. <laughs> For the people who doesn't who don't know about anything about Nijmegen. This is a city in the province of Helderland in the Netherlands. We are very close to the German border. Should be only 60 or 80 kilometers from here. So we are very close to the Germany. All right, I'll try to show you. Let me try to show you the map which I took today. All right. Well, it seems I can't do that. Oh, okay. I don't know if you can see that. This is the red red point is where we are. As you see, it's very close to the German border and it's pretty far away from Amsterdam Centrum. Hello Pablo T. Yes, we have a great weather today, 16 Celsius. It might be the last sunny day. Uh, in Nijmegen until May I mean because we are in October and it's almost like a spring weather it's 16 Celsius here's a fish stall there's a long queue here I think 
is a famous one. Five herring fish for 10 euro. If you buy only one, two euro and 12, 20 cents. And also kibbling, kabul yao and lekkerbek, other popular fish in the Netherlands. Fish and chips, 8 euro 50 cents. Muslim, 50 euro, 5 euro I mean, not 50. Shrimps with garlic. 5 euro and 50 cents and sal salmon, salmon salmon fish 8 euro not an not mix stall Right. Some vegetables. Corn. Cheaper than Amsterdam price. <laughs> Avocados two for two euro. Pretty cheap. Banana, Chris, fresh. And this is the marketplace. This is the square where people get together next to Waking House and the Stevens Church. Also, there are bars and restaurants towards to the square. Bakery. Rogers, two euro fifty cents. Rogers. This package is two euro fifty cents. It's pretty cheap. It's half baked, so you warm it in your oven. This is cocos, cocos cookies. Five of them, six euro. And some cloths. Oops, no, no exit here. This looks good. How much is that? 38. 38 euro. This tiger, tiger cloth. It's Indian, it seems, or Pakistan, I don't know. Yeah, 38 euro this one, sweatshirt. And there's a bodyguard version. That's one of the main shopping streets of Nijmegen and that way goes to the riverside, the wall it's an extension of Rhine River so the downsides there are many other restaurants also uh, at the riverside, riverbank Tibor, thank you so much for your super chat for my drink, thank you Now it's such a beautiful weather today wow. and it looks pretty crowded after local mark check I'm gonna explore that shopping street I will use that 
money for my espresso later. Tibor, thank you. Look at the gorgeous view in my American Central. That's the church we visited at the beginning of the video. And yes, this is Waking Girls. Street performance, one tongue, is it? To be honest, I don't remember that, but it was such a great weather again on my last visit. I remember that. Actually, today I saw a musical band and they told us they will be in this the centrum the whole afternoon. Maybe you can see them on our route. I think wide angle is better for your view. 30 year old woman clothes. Twenty euro Green trouser fifteen euro top twenty euro This looks a bit Turkish so we see that also in the Netherlands it's possible. <laughs> I'll try to find that band. So the watch battery, five euro, they say. So watch and bags. This is something fetish. I think this is kind of fetish clock. <laughs> wow. We found a fetish stall in the local markets. That Another gorgeous historic building is here. I forgot to mention for the newcomers, this is the oldest city in the Netherlands, according to the current records. Nijmegen is the oldest city in the Netherlands. Next to the German border, it was built by Romans. There are some Roman ruins from 11th century in a park, like 15 minutes from here. The riverside is beautiful, but today I don't have time to go there. In our previous video, we already visited Riverside. So today I was just walking around the centrum and around the local market shopping street. This is... This looks like a bit Muslim. Muslim shop, I think. Yes, multicultural Nijmegen stalls. Could be Indian, Pakistan, Muslim. And the prices are quite cheaper, 10 euro. 10 euro Muslim clothes. Being Muslim is cheap, you see. <laughs> Samira. And socks. Thermal socks. Three of them, 12 euro 50 cents. Winter warmers, wow, look at that. Locks the heat in. The iconic thermal sock. I think those are more expensive, I think. That's what you need in the Netherlands. And 
churros and this is the stat house the municipality house I see a lumpia place again Vietnam lumpia Leslie, I think I might have to visit this town love this tour thanks so much Leslie, special I meaning per meter three euro and this is the lumpia special mini lumpia three euro ninety cent it's so crowded so This is the Lumpia place. Let's go further. Of course, there is a Stroop waffle place. Dutch Stroop waffle. And? First, took one. Okay, Stroop waffle. One package. Well, it's 10 euro. Crocodile, croc leather. Bags, 15 euro, 17. Going back, 20 euro. What's that? Music. Okay, I'm running away because of copyright problems. Okay, first time I see a Pokemon stall in a local market in the Netherlands. Pokemon. Yes. Hi. Oops. Okay, if you live in the Netherlands and if you have a bicycle, you need that kind of strong <laughs> chains. Especially in Amsterdam, if you don't use a strong uh, chain, it will be stolen. But actually, it doesn't matter how strong it is. If someone is determined to steal your bicycle, he will get it anyway. Per kilo, 11 euro. Discount. 4 euro, 5 euro, 5 euro, 6 euro, something. And the big ones per kilo, 13 euro almost. There are different type of cheeses. I think this one is spicy. Extra ripe. I see the sun. <laughs> okay, that's the actual marketplace actually, and uh, there is a construction over there, and also there is a park uh, for children. That's why they moved the local market on the street. So I'm gonna return 
I'm gonna be returning to the main shopping street. By the way, Nijmegen was chosen uh, as the green capital of Europe in 2018. because of their environment friendly projects bike lanes nature well preserved nature etc okay running away from the music again because of this copyright things, I have to move faster. Paolo Melo, I'm drinking a double espresso with you, different mods. Thank you, Paolo Melo. Me too. If I see a fast, quick espresso place, I will do that. Today I have a limited time again because I have a meeting this evening with my friends. I don't have much time, so I will finish this video strictly in an in an hour lately maybe tomorrow I will consume more and more espressos <laughs> this is an open-air shopping mall similar to the one in Zandam I think also in Rotterdam I think it's a popular um, shopping mall structure for the Netherlands so two floors upstairs and downstairs unfortunately we are in the opposite direction of the light sorry about that soon we will be getting rid of that Let's see. Maybe we should go down. By the way, today I visited the worst, longest 3D printed bridge in Nijmegen. And I made a video. I will share that video next week as a vlog. Let's take a look down. Oops. There's a little part space over there. Oops. Another locomotive. Oh my god. They play copyrighted music everywhere today. Please do not play. The music you don't own. This is more like a book and music market. So I will leave the area quickly because probably they play music everywhere here. Okay, this is a historic restaurant Arsenal from 1824. Arsenal restaurant also in Northern another historic town in the Netherlands look at the disco ball half open disco ball and a little party children entertainment Everything is about the children in the Netherlands. Okay. The guy is so slow, I will not wait for that. Mm. 
Nijmegen locals are enjoying the last sunny weather today probably the last one until May or April and it's 16 Celsius even it's sunny on the next week it will not be warm like this I guarantee that and in the morning it was 8 Celsius now it's 16 Goede dag, Robin. Dank u wel. Oké, okay, nu ga ik slow down. Because we arrived to the main shopping street. It is. What a day! Summer forgot one day in autumn. Let's go towards there. Let's find a good espresso place and make Tibor and Paolo happy. <laughs> I don't have my favorite coffee shop in Nijmegen. I know only one. The one I visited on my last video. Oh, another Vietnam street food over there. In the corner. Vietnam street food. Everyone goes to the other direction. I think I'm in the wrong way. Did you see the grandma? She's not staying even on the bike. Lost that flag with pride. 
Pride is in August, but maybe there is another Pride in Nijmegen, I don't know. It's celebrated in August in Amsterdam. Maybe in Gelderland province, it's different. Right. Looks good. Let's go to the espresso place. Here's some Dutch music. We are back to our fish stall, which I showed herring fish in the beginning. Unfortunately, we couldn't see the music band. Maybe they finished or maybe they are resting somewhere. I don't know. It's a pity. They were good. Okay, I think this is one of the most beautiful streets of Nijmegen because there are many interesting shops and cafes, restaurants. Or stone sites. No cars, just bike and walk. Yeah, in the city centrum. In the old town, yes, it's true. And still gorgeous view of Stevenskerk. Well, I hear the sounds of the music band, so I will go back and I was, I'm gonna show you. Okay, we changed the plan. I was actually going towards to the coffee place, but I'm hearing the sounds of the music band. I found them.
Hello, Zabovich Tot. I can't pronounce your name, sorry. Yes, definitely. I can hear their sound. Approximately they are a few minutes away from here. Yes, every weekend I am in a different city of the Netherlands. I think they are at the same place where I saw them before the video I think all that this village uh, is so similar yeah in a way it's correct as a shape structure architecture they are very similar but always there is something extraordinary something important in that village or towns maybe you can hear the sound now they are on the next corner soon we are gonna see them can you hear the sound they make so much noise beautiful noise This Rosendahl is the worst place in the Netherlands. I don't know why I haven't been there yet, but I will visit. Carnival, yes. Carnival sound. I don't know what carnival is that. Normally once a year there is a big festival here in Nijmegen, four days march. It's in July, I think. Wow, it's so crowded. I'm gonna try to find a place. Give me a minute.
Yeah. What a performance. I think you like that. <laughs> this is the end of the performance and also end of the video actually because I have 10 minutes left to start cycling to the train station. I have 10 minutes cycling to the train station and I have to find my bicycle. My foldable bike is with me today in Nijmegen. I will be heading to Amsterdam Central and I will be there in the evening with my friends. One Kong, that was a treat, thank you. <laughs> I'm so happy to do it. To find them. Actually I was going to the coffee shop and the riverside and I was going to show you that some interesting shops in that street but we will postpone it for another time because I heard the sound and we follow them. I like them. It's great. I mean I'm not a professional but I like the sound. Okay, this is a short quick tour. Thank you so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow I will have another live stream tour, maybe in Amsterdam. I will decide it tomorrow, maybe in Den Haag, maybe in Amsterdam. I will decide it tomorrow. Or maybe in Amsterdam North. We will see that tomorrow. Uh, it depends on the weather and my time, etc. So, that's all for today. See you tomorrow, hopefully. <laughs> Goodbye. Have a great day. Ah, by the way, because I reached 10,000 subscribers, uh, merchandise option is available for my channel. So now I can sell t-shirts, hats, etc. Something. I will design some professional things about Amsterdam and the Netherlands. But for now, uh, for now I made two or three samples. You can see that on the below of the video right. and uh, so you can see that if you wish you can order it's a partnership with YouTube actually hey Moldova you're welcome thank you Paolo see you tomorrow yes tomorrow we will do that double espresso <laughs> Thanks you so much for hitting the like button. Also one point. Natkaya, görüşmek üzere. This festival was in Nijmegen. Sahara Jesh from India. See you. Goodbye.